everyone, welcome back to another construction online training video. My name is Drew, and today we're going to be going over how to add a contact to your contact list within construction online. We're going to start out in the contacts and companies tab under the left hand toolbar. And then we're going to go to contacts. And then it'll bring us to our contact list. We're going to click add new contact. Here's going to let us choose which type of contact we want to add. We're going to choose basic contact. It's going to prompt us to enter our first name, a last name, and an email address. Alternatively, you do have the option to import a contact. You can do this from an Excel file. We have a template available that you can download, but we'll save that for another video. We're going to add our contact information in. Once we have it entered in correctly, we can press continue. Here it will search for existing construction online contacts from the database. If we see the person we want, we can add the contact. If we don't see the person we want to add, we can enter in their details manually. So here's where we can enter in the contacts details. You can see that there are a multitude of different things to choose from here, like the company, different contact group, maybe which office or division they're in. You can rate the contact with a star rating. Let's say John is a three star contact. Obviously you can enter in their phone, mobile, different provider as well, a website if you'd like, and then their address. Once you have the information in that you would like to have for the contact, you can press add contact and it'll be added for you. Once you create a contact, you'll notice that there are public details and private details. Private details are for your company only. That is internal and that will be only things that you can see. Public details are what everyone can see within Construction Online. Only the contact themselves can edit this information in the public details. You can also see which projects this contact is added to. You can see the game plan for this contact. You can delete the contact if you'd like. You can also add attachments such as files and photos to the contact's details. You can press save once you're done. And your contact will be added to your list. That'll be all for today's tutorial. If you have any additional questions, feel free to ask them through our live chat or search our knowledge base. And as always, have a fantastic day.